Hey guys, it's uh, I comes before you zero here, and I'm here to show you how to reduce your lag and increase your uh, frames per second in uh, World of Warcraft. I know I have one video like this, but this one goes into uh, more advanced settings. Uh, before you leave comments on why is the screen um, glitching up so badly, uh, it's because my graphics is really high and the video capture studio that I'm using. Uh, it doesn't doesn't capture this high that well, uh, but I'm going to tell you the options to go to anyway. So the first thing I want you guys to do is go to EXC and uh, then hit video. And when when it brings up the the video menu, uh, be under the tab graphics, uh, and then go to texture resolution. Actually, you don't even need to do this. You can just go and drag this bar uh, for the graphics bar all the way down to low and then go to advanced and make sure everything on the right is unchecked and then go to the reduce input lag tab uh, if you enable this uh, it will decrease uh, the amount of times that you lag out uh, but if you um, disable this uh, then it's going to increase your uh, frame rate by about uh, five per second so as soon as you hit OK, it's going to minimize your game and then just bring it back right up uh, again. Uh, at the beginning of this, I was running at about 2 frames per second, and now I'm running at about 20 uh, to 23. <clears throat> so now let's get into the uh, more advanced settings. So let's exit game here. As soon as you um, exit game, uh, click your Start menu, and then go to Control Panel. Now at the top right, go to your search bar, and then just type NV. Um, and then click your NVIDIA control panel. If you're not using NVIDIA, um, just go to whatever control panel that you're using uh, to run your games on. And as soon as you go to that, uh, go up to your first um, tab, and then use the advanced 3D image settings for that. Uh, go to the second tab, uh, do high performance NVIDIA processor, uh, go to the third tab and then with the uh, NVIDIA settings go to the fourth tab use the NVIDIA settings for both of those and then hit X and it'll ask you if you want to apply uh, we're gonna hit yes here and then as soon as that's done we're gonna X out the control panel and go to our computer as soon as we go to the computer go to the search bar in the top right and type world of and then it'll uh, it'll give you a few, few folders for uh, World of Warcraft or whatever you're using, the one you want to click on is data. As soon as you do that, uh, the first folder in there is going to be cache. Uh, we're going to delete this cache folder and what the cache folder basically does is it stores up graphics so that as soon as you start your game, uh, it, it'll uh, load faster because um, it already has the graphics uh, saved in there. And we're just going to go ahead and delete the cache folder, it's going to ask us if we're sure we're going to click yes and then X that out. And the last thing I'm going to ask you to do while the game's not running is uh, click help, go to repair tool, and click repair. Uh, I'm not going to do that right now because I've already done this before I started recording. So I'm just going to start um, World of Warcraft up uh, real quick. And again, it's going to take a while because you deleted the. Uh, the graphics that it's been accessing uh, in, in World of Warcraft. And as soon as that happens, just type in your password. Um, and once you're logged in, uh, look at the bottom left hand uh, side of the screen. There will be a little tab called Add-ons. Um, I want you to disable all of your add-ons and then click OK. And as soon as you do that, uh, you can log back into your character and if you don't want your add-ons, you can go into whatever um, uh, place that you installed your add-ons or your computer and delete them from there. Um, personally, I use uh, Woe Matrix. Uh, but it, it'll take a little while to log in here and uh, as soon as you log in there will be a little thing that it's saying it's downloading game data 
what it's basically doing is just reloading some of the graphics that we just deleted, but it won't reload them all. It'll just reload the ones that uh, are necessary um, to run your game. So at the beginning of this video, I was running at about two frames per second, and now I'm running at about uh, 60 frames per second. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, tutorial, and uh, remember to subscribe, and if you have any comments or questions, uh, just message me or leave them in the comments. And thanks for watching.